Hello YouTube. The next effect or the next thing I want to teach you is using an eye. Now I changed the pupil to the shape of an heart and I changed the color of the eye while taking the color out the rest of the eye. Now this is really easy. Okay? It seems hard but it's not really. Just open up your eye picture. Okay? Then what you want to do is you want to change the pupil first. So you need to get a template for a heart. But I have one. I just got something like this. Then all I did was I just filled it up with black paint and there was my template. Then just put everything, make it float all in windows. That basically means that you can take layers from the one and put them in the other and like that. So I just take this layer and I put it into this document. I can close that one now because I'm not using it anymore. I go window, arrange, consolidate. Consolidate all to tabs. Then it's back to how it was. Then if I just take my move thing, my move tool, and I go free transform, I can bring it back down to size now while holding shift so I don't lose the shape of it. Now I'm gonna just turn the opacity down so I can see like where I'm putting it so I can get the right size. You want to make it so that the bottom of your heart is just the size of the of the pupil. So like, like around there. Okay, then you can turn the opacity back up to 100%. Now this doesn't look too real. So what we're going to do is we're going to change the blend mode to overlay, and then we're going to take we're going to put a mask on it. First, go to press place. We're going to put a mask on it so we can. Then we're going to change our paintbrush. Get a soft brush. Get the size right. Now, now what we can do is we can, we can blend it out a little bit along the sides just to make it just a little bit more um, realistic just around like that okay now we've done the pupil it'll look a lot better when it's got the color in now we can merge these two layers because now this is our eye okay now we want to change the color of the eye so what we're going to do is we're going to use our old same trick, gradient tool, go to our rainbow, we're going to start it over here and we're going to end it over there so we get all the colors inside the eye. Change that to overlay, there we go. Now what we're going to do is we're going to merge these two layers. No we're not yet. We first, we first need to add a mask to this layer, go to our paint brush again, pick the size up because we're going to be uh, erasing quite a bit. What we're going to do is we're going to make sure we're on black, then go around it, make sure you take away all of it, okay, Okay, now this is colorful. Now, if you want to make this image black and white, all we do is you go to hue and saturation. And you just put this all the way, to, just put the saturation all the way to where it's not red, where it's white, and that will make it. That'll make it black and white. And now you can see the spots you've missed in this. So you can just fix it up, fix it up, fix it up, miss. Make sure you get all the spots you missed. There you go, there's a spot around here. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and comment. Thanks very much.